Today I want to show you how I'm using a Focusrite 2i4 to record Skype. And because Skype acts a specific way, we can use this to record not only to an audio recorder as a backup or a primary, but also to the same computer into software also as a backup or a primary. So the easiest way to use this device or really any audio interface to record Skype is to connect to Skype via USB. In this case, you can go out USB or line out and use some Skype recording software for the Mac or for Windows. But what's really ideal is to have a backup recording because something could go wrong. So because Skype only hears the uh, left channel, essentially you have two channels here on this particular device, which is the 2i4. We'll put our microphone into channel one and Skype will only get that audio. So this is a plus and a minus. I can't put in two microphones and have Skype hear it. Now, because it does that, you can take Skype out of your computer, out of the headphone out, and you bring it back in to channel two. And so in that setup, you have your audio going out and you have Skype's audio coming back in. And then via the USB, you make that your input to software like Audacity or Adobe Audition, uh, QuickTime, whatever you have. And in my case with Audition, I'm gonna be able to set that up to record actual separated tracks. So that's ideal. Check your software if you can do that. But in Audition, I'm gonna set it up so that Audition hears channel one and channel two separately. In this case, it'll be one of them will be my microphone. One of them will be Skype. So I'm gonna have two separated channels to work with in post-production, which is an added benefit. And you can do that in most Skype recording software as well. But again, here we have a backup. Now I could also at the same time or in place of go to an audio recorder. And even in a two track stereo recorder, the 2i4 offers another cool function. It has the ability to monitor the audio, either stereo or mono. When you put it mono, obviously both channels are blended together. In stereo mode, it'll pan channel one and channel two, uh, left and right respectively. So you can even separate in the recorder. So again, we've got this connected to Skype. It's only hearing channel one. We've got Skype coming back in. And now since Skype's only getting channel one, we don't have to worry about it hearing itself. It's a fake mix minus. It's not really a mix minus, but because Skype doesn't hear channel two, we don't have to worry about sending its own audio back in there. But because our software also hear both channels, we can record to them on the same computer. So Focusrite 2i4 recording to separated channels to recorder or software on the same computer with a backup. Ask your questions in the comments. See you next time.